and hello again my loves we are doing um part four now we're on like number four of my um femme Lux haul i should say um i've got four new um pieces to review this time as you can see one is obviously going to be a pair of jeans but um they'll be pretty interesting um so just in order from one two three four sorry i told the piece of paper in my mouth there um but yeah in order of one two three four so top left we've got the midwash rip straight leg jeans also known as lucy in a size six um on the top right corner will be the white polka dot mesh overlay bodysuit which is also known as abra in size six we've also got the white mesh polka dot top also known as sandy in white in a size six as well sorry i had to just double check that <laughs> um and then last but not least obviously that little black number is the black mesh frill v neckline bodysuit which is also known as Jayla in a size six to eight so also classed as size small onto the unwrapping um so first one is the jeans now i've always wanted a pair of like these are going to be crop jeans i've always wanted a pair of crop jeans don't ask me why i don't know um just to try out so this is the pair that I've got. As you can see, they're quite big rips in some parts to the point I have this piece flapping around everywhere. Um, the cut is a straight, complete frayed cut at the bottom. Um, but yeah, as you can tell, these are crop jeans, unless you're like really, really super short. Um, obviously no rips or anything on the back. It'll be interesting because I never normally do straight leg. I normally tend to do like skinny or super skinny um so yeah so like a baggy pair will be pretty interesting but the plus point of that is um if you're into layering whether it's tights or fishnets or anything like that they'll actually come in handy because it's so hard to try and layer with like fishnets and like super skinny jeans i can't tell you the struggle <laughs> so second one is the abra Body suit. I have to keep forget. I've got two like creamy white pieces, so I've got to keep checking. Ah, oh, now this is cute. This is super cute. So cute little bodysuit. Obviously, completely mesh, see throughy. So we'll wear like a really nice bralette with that. Um, no cuff sleeves. Now, what's interesting is this bodysuit part. I've never seen a bodysuit like this in my life. To the point they've got these strappy little things going on. So that'll be pretty interesting. I mean, cool, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to expect with that. But otherwise, that's what we're working with. Right, number three is the Sandy, which is obviously another white um, or cream mesh bodysuit. Is this a bodysuit? No, sorry, it's a top. Tell her that it's a top. So it'd be great to do for summer. Oh, now this is a cute little number. Hold on, we'll do it like this. This is a cute little number, like nice little high neck collar, button back. There's two buttons at the top. Um, nice kind of like balloon arms, elasticated cuff, so you know it's gonna um sit quite nice. Quite like this. It's quite cute. Woo. Okay. I'm kind of excited to try that one now. And lastly is the Jayla, which is a frill neck bodysuit. Oh my god. Oh, I'm getting lost in it. Hold on. Okay, right, here we go. It's just because there's no like tag at the bottom. Oh, sorry, not the bottom, at the top to like show me. Which... Oh, I'm so glad, yes. <laughs> okay, it's hard because I'm wearing black as well, but um, I'm going to have to probably check out the chick wearing it okay now i've got front and back sorted now hold on right here we go so as you see it's completely frilly um not balloony arms or anything just normal straight cut arms but what this is how i got confused because you only see the frills at the front like that this frills exactly the same at the back so i got really confused there as to oh my god what's going on so this is pretty cute actually um and once again a normal this is what a normal bodysuit would look like no like weird strappy things going on around the thighs but otherwise it's quite heavy you know like with the frills and stuff it's actually quite heavy i didn't expect that but yeah 
this cute little bodysuit we're going to be doing. Right, let's get trying these on now. Good bodysuit, the one with all the little strappy thingy bobs on them. But um, I've got to say, it is so cute. Like, so cute. It fits really, really nice. Um, sleeves are a tad bit short, I have to admit. It would be nice if they actually sort of sat there rather than where they are, but it's fine. It just, I suppose I'll probably just wear it scrunched like this or something. Um, fits really, really cool. Don't ask me what I did with that strappy business, even I don't know. I gave up with it in the end. But it's one that you'll have to pull up from the legs. So you know some bodysuits, obviously you can unpin it so you can get it over your head, adjust it, everything, then clip it. This is literally, you've got to pull it up like this. Um, oh, it's really, really nice fit. Um, I love the mesh. This is one you could easily wear on holiday, night out. I probably wouldn't recommend the office or anything, even though I've sort of geared it up to be quite formal-ish. Um, but no, I've got to say, I love the fit. Um, I love like the sheerness of it and everything. Really cute polka dot design as well. And I'll just show you the back. It's so cute. It's like super, super cute. The quality is all right as well, to be fair. The quality is not too bad. That's what I mean. So you get like, obviously, because I keep mine quite high waisted anyway. But just if you are wearing like, say, lower pair of jeans or trousers or skirts, um, you will find the fact that you will be having that show in. Um, otherwise, this is really cute. I'll probably give this a, I'll probably say a seven out of 10, actually, if I to rate it, just purely because, like I said, it could be a little bit better. The sleeve length could be a little bit nicer. Um, that weird strappy thing doesn't need to be going on, but never mind. Otherwise, I think this is really cute. And onto the black piece. Now, I've got to say, I love this piece. This is gonna be, one of my favourites, even though this is probably the second piece I've tried on, it's one of my favourites. So, um, I managed to get the filling right, so just so you know, it's obviously v-neck at the front, it's supposed to be plunge, but it's not really plunge. Um, and then the back is more of a round neck, but you still obviously get the filling. Um, obviously I wore a bra underneath mine, but just if you're going to go on a night out, you'd probably just do like modesty covers or something, um, or like a clear bra or whatever. Anyway, um, so first things first, let me just show you the fact that when the frilling stops and then it becomes this really nice like sort of satin bit, so once again it's high-waisted, so this probably works better with high-waisted skirts, jeans, trousers, um, or anything high, basically. Um, otherwise you will be seeing that satin patch all the way around. Um, the sleeves, I've got to say, I really do love, like proper, proper elasticated, so they fit really, really well. Um, and also love that really nice ballooning effect that it's got going on. Do you know what I mean? It looks quite nice and loose and um, just really chic, actually. Let me just show you the frilling. The frilling's really nice. Like I said, it's slightly heavy, but nothing to like really, really worry about. If I show you the back. Um, obviously, the back's got like a nice little bit of a V-shape going on too. Um, oh, there we go. It looks a little bit better now, actually. Cause it's sort of like an off the shoulder kind of effect that's going on with it really but um really nice i have to admit and then obviously it's like a nice mesh body all around um obviously i paired it once again with my skirt and then obviously i did black stockings with it um i don't think it'd be appropriate for the office once again unless you wear like just a black simple cami top underneath to hide most of the mesh paneling um oh it's just really nice you know i love the fit Quality is quite, quite nice actually, I've got to say. Um, not too sure if you guys can see, but it's that sort of like micro netting kind of thing. Kind of clingy, I'll probably say semi clingy. Um, still really great though. And it's obviously like that all around the body and everything as well. Um, yeah. Oh, I didn't realise it did that, look at that. Um, yeah, so in all in all, I'll probably give this an eight, maybe potentially nine out of 10 because I love this I think this is really really nice I love this bodysuit that's a gorgeous bodysuit I'm not going to go any lower than this but I just wanted to show you but yeah lovely lovely bodysuit and yeah definitely recommend now this one I thought I would um actually combine them both together sorry I had to flip that back then um 
just because I thought it would make quite a nice cute outfit really. Um, so the first one obviously is the really cute top, um, which I thought was obviously a bodysuit to be with, but it's not. Um, I've got to say it's so sweet, like, so obviously as you can see it's high neck, um, two button closure at the back, if you guys can see that. Um, mesh all round, which is really, really cute, which means you can wear like loads of different bralettes. And like the bonus point here is, um, this is really elasticated, so it'll sit quite nice, obviously, depending on where you want to sit it. Um, I wouldn't do it quite high because it just looks a bit odd. But otherwise, this is quite nice, you know. Um, really nice material, really flowy. Um, once again, like that kind of netted, which is quite cute. Um, but probably a pain to iron as well if you ever needed to iron it. Now the jeans, I've got to say, are a little bit a little bit loose. So these are a size six, and I've got like loads of room at the back. So I definitely need to have a belt with this for sure. Um, let me just move back so you can actually see the whole thing. So you still can't even see the whole thing. Anyway, so what um, you guys can see here is these aren't crop at all. These literally sit like ankle grazer. So what I've done is instead I'm actually going to like roll them up like this so they sit like a little bit higher. Um, all I've done is just taken them up twice just to sort of get rid of the hemming part. But I probably will need to play around with it a little so as you can see. Um, I'm not too sure if I like this whole massive rip thing including this little piece of something that's not doing anything. I might just have to like create a couple of stitches there or something. Um, Otherwise, it's okay, the fit's okay, it's, as you can see, it's quite baggy, um, but obviously some people really like that fit. I'm just, I'm just not used to it, so it, it's pretty odd for me, but it's kind of nice though, I have to admit, it's actually kind of nice. But um, otherwise, yeah, I was, I was, like I said, I was a little bit disappointed in the fact that these aren't crop, and that they're just sort of ankle grazer length. Um, if that was the case, like, I could have bought an old pair of jeans, really. Um, otherwise, actually, let me see if I can show you guys closer without, like, sticking my foot up in the air. Like, so, like, but yeah, this is what I mean when I said, like, obviously, you'd be folding them up. Um, otherwise, they'll be sitting, like, there and I'm not a massive fan of that, so. But no, otherwise, you know, so I mean, like, double, just double folding it back up. Otherwise, um. I want to say, I really like the top, the jeans I'm a bit mm with, jeans I'd probably give like a 5 or 6 out of 10 I'd say, just purely because like I say, like, a bit of a loose fit, um, whereas like I would quite, you know, I'd like it like really nice and fitted if, if it's going to be baggy the whole way down, um, but yeah, the top I definitely do, like the top I'd probably give an 8, purely because it's just cute, it is really, really cute, and, and I love it really, right, so, Hopefully, fingers crossed, that'll be a part five.